we didn't hear one word out of the woman and child minister and now she's talking about some flying fish where the honorable prime minister tells the governor chup raho where we as elected mps in this house are routinely told chup raho the most pressing issue of the day where we are all supposed to raho chup prime minister refuses to come to this house of which he is an elected member to answer us on manipur When a BJP MP was accused of harassment and molestation by our champion wrestlers, one we didn't hear one word out of the woman and child minister, and now she's talking about some flying kids. What are your priorities? We are here to ask the questions in our Tum Abhi Chup Raho Republic, where the Honorable Prime Minister tells the Governor, Chup Raho, where we as elected MPs in this house are routinely told, Chup Raho. This motion is to break this omerta, this code of silence on Manipur, the most pressing issue of the day, where we are all supposed to raho chup. And now we are told that it is the BJP's master strategy that even with this motion, the honourable Prime Minister has not come to the house day before yesterday. He has not come yesterday. He has not yet come today. वो थोड़ी ना बैठकर आपकी सुनेंगे, वो तो लास्ट दिन आएंगे और आर बस अब सब की धज्जियाँ उड़ा के जाएंगे. Fine, we are waiting. No problem. I don't know what is more unfortunate that our honourable prime minister refuses to come to this house of which he is an elected member to answer us on Manipur, or that he refuses to go to Manipur to reassure his honourable petrified people that peace and reconciliation are his mission. The honourable prime minister, if you are listening, I beg you on behalf of the people of Manipur, change the administration. Allow all parties to work together to mediate a truce. Otherwise, even after your term ends, India will echo in one voice as to what went so terribly wrong in Manipur, with such terrible consequences for our country. The issue is that two communities today in Manipur have been pitted against each other in an atmosphere of civil war, of ethnic violence that has rarely been seen in India in the past few decades. Six thousand five hundred FIRs in three months. Which state has seen this? 150 people died in three months. Which state has seen this? 300 places of worship destroyed. Which state has seen this? An armed standoff between the Manipur Ri State Police and the Assam Rifles captured on video. One controlled by the Minister of Home Affairs, other controlled by the State Police. Which state has seen this? Only Manipur. No other state. Only Manipur. So stop your water boundary. Stop your false equivalences. Address the problem, Honourable Prime Minister. As a government in the centre, which is also ruling the state of Manipur, this is your biggest failure of the double engine sarkar. So let us not insult other states by saying, "What about Rajasthan? What about Haryana? What about Chhattisgarh?" Manipur is a tacitly approved hate crime. Make no mistake. This is civil war. These are crimes against humanity. The heart. If you like this video, then like, share, and subscribe to Mirror Now.